JBN we keep you informed. I am Michelle Jones and in the news, two more young lives snuffed out in the West. Please remember to subscribe, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items. A 17-year-old Westmoreland boy was gunned down in a hail of bullets early this morning. Jerry Francis, otherwise called Jay, of Ricketts Street in Savlamar, was discovered with multiple gunshot wounds in a yard along Ricketts Avenue. Residents reported that about 3 a.m., they heard a barrage of gunshots coming from the direction of a yard along Ricketts Avenue. The police were called to the area. The team that responded discovered Francis beside the house lying in blood with multiple gunshot wounds to his upper body. The scene was processed and the body was removed to the morgue for a post-mortem. Over in St. James, a 22-year-old man was shot and killed during a drive-by shooting in Rose Heights on Wednesday night. The deceased man has been identified as Giovanni Brown of an Amity, Cambridge address in the parish. According to the police, Brown was attending a birthday party in a section of Rose Heights called Village Top when the shooting occurred. Information received is that the now deceased man was standing with a group of individuals at approximately 10.45 p.m. on Wednesday when the occupants of a black Toyota Corolla motor car opened gunfire, hitting him all over the body. The police were summoned, and upon arrival of the police, Brown was seen lying on the roadway in a pool of blood, a police source said. Brown was transported to the Cornwall Regional Hospital, where he was pronounced dead. Unconfirmed reports are that the man's shooting death is gang-related, as a well-placed source said that Brown was attached to the Perker gang, which is said to be located in Cambridge. JBN, we keep you informed. Please remember to subscribe, like, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items.